officially time to make an appointment with your barber and go for a hairstyle women really love. Hey you. So the first choice goes by many different names, including the businessman and the professional cut. And it's the preferred style of so many different men's style icons from Don Draper to Ryan Gosling. Yep the side part. Okay, so it's short, neat, and easy to maintain. The side part is just that classic swept over look that's basically like the bomber jackets of haircut. It's super timeless, super simple, and it looks great on pretty much every guy. Perfect for environments with a more formal dress code, this particular hairstyle is actually surprisingly versatile. And you can wear it in a ton of different ways depending on your specific hair type and stylistic preferences. Now, I personally like to recommend going for a taper or fade on the sides or a nice side swept effect. And if you want, you can even combine your side part with a pompadour for a look that's more stylish than ever. I'd also advise investing in a good pomade or mousse to use when you're combing the hair back and to the side. And you can always go for a little hairspray just to keep the whole thing in place. So when it comes to men's hair, there are trends that are always coming and going, but there are also certain looks that just never go out of style. Exhibit A, the crew cut. Smart, neat, and casual, the crew cut is one of those hairstyles that women just love on a guy because it shows that he is not only well-groomed, but also it has an air of sophistication. Now, it's a style that refuses to wane in popularity and celebrities like Ryan Reynolds, Brad Pitt, and Idris Elba have all harnessed its power, sporting different variations of its minimal look, including tight faded cuts and just more grown out styles. Super easy to achieve and maintain, the crew cut is tight on the sides and slightly longer on top. Now, this gives you more room to put your own spin on it and craft a look that reflects your personal sense of style. Now you can go for a classic minimalist office worthy look or try it swept to the side with a fade. Now one of the best things about the crew cut is that it can be achieved with all types of hair. And when it comes to face shapes, it works with diamond, oblong, and square faces. Also is a great option for guys with fine or thinning hair, as the longer top can hide any balding spots or thinning spots and draw attention away from re receding hairlines. Now, speaking of classic cuts that never go out of fashion, it's time to break out your Austin Butler Elvis impersonation because we're talking pompadours. Now, short on the back and sides, while long and swooped over on the top, this particular do comes in a variety of different interpretations, but my personal favorite is what's known as the modern pompadour. Now, this is a look that's a bit messier than the traditional version. So rather than being styled up and to the back, the modern pompadour sees all of your hair styled upwards, which adds considerable length to your face. Now, this makes it an ideal haircut for guys with square and oval shaped faces and thicker hair, and it also works great for accentuating a strong jaw. Now, achieving a perfect pomp takes practice with a comb and a hair dryer, but trust me, it'll be worth it. And I always recommend going for a water-based pomade for styling, as oil-based products can be a nightmare to wash out. Also, don't be afraid of using a little bit of hairspray to lock it in place. Now, this next one doesn't really have a name as it's not so much a specific hairstyle and more of a vibe. So it goes without saying that women just love a man with naturally messy, curly, or wavy hair. However, you never wanna go too messy to the point that your hair looks unruly, unkempt, or unwashed. Now, one of my personal favorite men's haircuts has actually the curly or wavy natural look that's just a little bit shorter on the sides. And let me explain why. Though it gets a bit of a bad rep when it comes to styling, curly or super wavy hair has a natural volume and texture that can just be so damn sexy if worn correctly. Now, keeping it shorter on the sides not only frames the face, but it also adds a greater feeling of volume to your overall appearance. And just how short you go, I mean, it's entirely up to you. Now, you could go for a classic taper that's just a bit shorter than what you've got on top, 
or you could even go for something like a gradual fade, the tightness of which will add some balance to the volume on top. Now we have a men's hairstyle first popularized in the 1950s, but trust me, it still looks as good today as it did back then, the quiff. So short on the sides with a lot of volume on top, it's messy and relaxed look. I mean, it's just great on guys of all ages and face shapes. Now you might be asking, what's the difference between a quiff and a pompadour? Great question. So though the two styles might look very similar, a pompadour is heavier and is brushed or combed in a backward direction. And a quiff on the other hand is created by brushing the hair forward to create a vertical look at the top of the head. Also pompadours tend to be tight and shiny while quiffs are usually just a bit messier and looser. And when choosing a style of quiff, you wanna make sure that the length is dependent on your specific face shape. So basically, if you have a thin face, you want to go shorter as once again, going too long on top can only make your face look longer and narrower. You have been warned. Now, like all of these hairstyles, my biggest piece of advice is to play around with it until you find a style that works for you. So this next hairstyle is one that women find simply irresistible. It's super low maintenance, yet just, I mean, it seems to ooze confidence. Rocked by everyone from Adam Levine to Channing Tatum, it's the buzz cut. I mean, women just love a good buzz cut and it's not hard to see why. There's something so bold and rebellious about just sharing it all off. And if you're the adventurous type or enjoy spending time outdoors, then this particular haircut is for you as it's so easy to manage and will also keep you relatively sweat free. Now this is a hairstyle that works well on most face shapes, but be warned that if your face is on the rounder side, then it can make it appear even rounder. So I'd recommend the crew cut instead. Also, a buzz cut is a style that best suits guys with a strong bone structure as tight haircuts really emphasize both the jawline and cheekbones, allowing for a chiseled masculine look that women go crazy for. Now, if you're a black guy, one of my favorite variations of this particular style has got to be the faded buzz. I mean, it's just so fresh and requires very little maintenance to keep looking good. Now, if your hair is thinning on top, then a buzz cut really is your best friend as it will not only give you a cleaner look, but it can also help hair follicles to grow back thicker if you wanna grow it out later in the year. Now, if you do end up giving the buzz cut a try, then don't forget that your scalp is going to need some protection from those harmful UV rays outside. Now I'd recommend investing in a sprayable sunscreen that is specifically designed for your scalp as the regular kind will just be too oily and will clog up your hair follicles. Now regular trims around every three to four weeks are also a must if you want to keep this style in check. Now speaking of haircuts that work for men who might be thinning on top, one of my favorite moves has got to be the contrasted bald look. Not completely bald, but not the living in denial horseshoe style either. This style leaves a little bit of stubble on top for some added texture. It's a look that has proved super effective for modern style icon Stanley Tucci, thanks in part to his incorporation of thick blocked glasses and a tactful use of facial hair. Now the contrasted bald style proves that though losing your hair can be painful, it really isn't the end of the world, especially if you can strategically highlight your other facial attributes and use them to your advantage. Now it worked for the tooch and it can work for you too.